Hey there guys, Shy Ranger here, and no I am not starting early on a new walkthrough, but instead I'm going to take a quick break and show you how to get the three Reggie Pokemon in, well I'm playing Emerald, but you can do this the same way in Sapphire and Ruby. Now to do this you're going to need some Pokemon. You're going to need a Relicanth, you're going to need a Wailord, you're going to need a Pokemon that learns Surf, I'm sure you can teach it to Wailord, but I have a different one. You're going to need a Pokemon that learns Dive. Again, same thing. But, and um, so since you need Dive, you're gonna. The earliest you can do this is after the Moss Deep Gym, but you can go to it later. Since I have a Mawile, so obviously I've done this a lot later. And you're also gonna need a Pokemon that knows Dig. Now you can either catch one that knows it somehow, or you can go to. Uh, you, ha you can get the TM for Dig, which is why we're at Fall Arbor and now at the Fossil Lover's House. You go to the Fossil Lover's House and talk to his... ...brother. And he gives you the TM for... ...Dig. And we are going to teach that... ...to... Oops. We are going to teach that to our Sand Slash. get rid of sand attack. Yeah, yeah, this isn't really funny right now because I have to explain so much. I have to explain to do... Yeah, there we go. Something. Anyway, now we're gonna fly, and as I do that, I should explain. To get Whale Lord, you're gonna have to evolve him from a Whale Mortar. To get a Whale Mortar, you fish. You can fish in various places, but like Moss Deep, but I got mine from the using the good rod on the coast of Lily Cove City. And he evolves at level 40, so it's gonna take a while. To get Relicanth, you're gonna have to dive and explore the undersea in the areas around Sutopla City. And now we're going to Pacific Log, right here. Because that is where we need to go. We're going there because we need to. Anyway. Can't run here, which is kind of annoying. Anyway. So now we're going to the current area. This is, could get annoying because if you screw up once. So you don't need a Pokemon that knows fly, but if you do, it'll make things a lot easier to get around. Anyway. Now, I think the current puzzle might be different if it goes from game to game. I know the trainers are, but anyway. This is how you do it in Emerald. You'd fight that guy if you haven't beaten him already. Which I have. I've beaten all the people up to here, so we'll be fine. Just have to stay to the bottom for pretty much the entire time until you get to the very end. Alright, now we get past these guys. And we go down. Ugh! Yes, I'm not using repels. I'll just skip these. I'm gonna be doing various parts because you actually have to go around the whole area, so. Anyway. Luckily, you don't encounter wall in the current. That would make things look really annoying. Anyway, just keep doing that over and over again. And then you're gonna get to here, where it's this big area. Um, you have to stand in the exact spot. Start at the bottom and go two steps up. And then you surf. Now you're gonna end up here. Now you have to use dive in this area. Now, I mean, you really don't need. I mean, I really don't use Tentacruel and Sand Slash that much. They're really HM slaves, but. With the Pokemon around here, you know, like at the surface, you might want them a little higher, but I don't know. It's your choice. Anyway. Now we get into the braille. It says go up here. So you're gonna go up, obviously. And now we are in the sealed chamber. All of these slabs just have all the letters in order. So like this it would show you A, B, C, D, E, F, and then the comma period. But anyway, what you wanna do, it says dig here. So you go, oh, 
Why did I go to my bag? And use dig and ignore that because watch what happens. See? All of these say stuff about like we sealed the Pokemon here to uncover the Ancient One, Ancient Three to be exact. Okay, now to do this, you just click on nothing happens. What you have to do is put Wailord at the front and Relicanth at the back, at the very bottom. And now It sounded as if a door opened somewhere, far away. Okay, now we're gonna have to go find those places. You do not need Wailord, Relic, or Relicanth, or a Surf- Well, you will need a Surfer, I'm sorry. You won't need your Dives character. You won't need Dig, either. But, I'm going to keep- For this team, for the- Getting the ancient Pokemon. Yes, they're ancient. What was the guess? I'm going to use Wailord and Relicanth because they're actually really good and Relicanth knows Yawn, which can help put him to sleep and catch them. Also, my regular team is too overpowered. You're also, in order to get them, you're going to need the Pokemon that you have that knows Rock Smash and the Pokemon that you have that knows Flash. Assuming you top Flash to a Pokemon. You, you should already have those HMs, so I'm going to meet you at the next spot. Okay, here we go. Okay, so now we're in Lava Ridge Town, and we're gonna go get the Pokemon in the desert. The cave that just opened near the desert. Now this is the only one you do not need Surf for, so if you don't have a good Pokemon that's using Surf, then you can get rid of it. Anyway, go down here, and again, oh. Shouldn't have any problem getting through these, because they're really weak. Hopefully we won't run out of time. Actually, we won't. It's really close. Like, really close. Like, right there close. Anyway. It's a very small cave, actually. This says, two left, two down, then use Rock Smash. Or something like that, anyway. Go left two. Go down two. And... You're gonna have to select Rock Smash manually. You can't press A. Okay, and right in here is the first Pokemon, which is, uh, yeah, this is Desert Ruins. Anyway, this is going to be Regirock. Suggest you save here, because this is the only time you're going to get him, so it is like a legend. I would consider him legendary status on how hard it is to get him, so make sure you stock up. Now, basically, I'm going to use the team that you, uh, I'll show right now. I'm going to use this team for the fight. And I'm gonna do probably do multiple takes, so I'll cut it here, and then I'll tell you which take, and you'll see the one. So yeah, you'll either see the first one if I'm really good, or the bad one where I'm just angry. So either way, you pretty much win. All right, here we go.